is gonna call his ex-wife and see if she can let me tell her kids that Santa Claus isn't real because they don't know it yet. Okay, all right, I'm texting her right Texting her right now. Are you awake? Are you awake? <laughs> I'm in the mood to disappoint you again. <laughs> <laughs> It's time. I found out when I was like seven. It's time because David's out of ideas. <laughs> <laughs> it's time because it's late the day before a posting <laughs> day. I want to tell your kids that Santa Claus isn't real. You just said surprise them. That's that's a surprise. surprise is something joyous. <laughs> like you find like a, like a puppy. You want to destroy them. That's what you want to do. <laughs> Santa Claus isn't real and your dad's a loser. <laughs> <laughs> Telling your daughter that the tooth fairy isn't real. That one you even think is ridiculous. Yeah. Yeah. She still believes in that? Farts. And she's mm. very smart. So what is it? I don't know. My, my ex doesn't doesn't want to break that sweetness about them. Well, you know what the worst part about it is? They go to school right. and they're gonna find out and it's not gonna be captured on video. Yeah. <laughs> I just love that your kids are so smart but they believe that. Like I can imagine Charlie in class being like, um, E equals MC squared. <laughs> also got this shirt from Santa. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna be the bad guy too. Cause they'll be like, Daddy, why didn't you tell me? And they're like, I look like an idiot from all my classmates. Yeah. Yes. Oh, this, this happened to me. Uh, my dad was in New York for 9-11 and up until the second grade, I thought, no one ever died in 9-11. My parents told me that no one died. And then second grade, we're sitting, we're doing show and tell, and 9-11 gets brought up somehow. I'm like, yeah, my dad was there. I'm like, but thankfully no one got hurt. <laughs> and the teacher <laughs> just looked at me and she goes, what? <laughs> and like, no one got hurt. And then everyone just started laughing. And I'm like, no. <laughs> and then they told me that people died. And I came home crying. <laughs> You don't want that to happen to your kids. Why don't we call your wife? Huh? Put her on speaker. I can't do that. You can? <laughs> Jason will jump, jump into a gorilla pit and get mauled by like tigers. <laughs> but not call his ex-wife. I just saw a look of like complete fear come over Jason. But David said, yeah, let's just call her right now and not tell her. And he goes, no, I can't. <laughs> no, I can't do that. <laughs> Screw you guys. I'll call her right now. Yes! He's going to call his ex-wife and see if she can let me tell her kids that Santa Claus isn't real because they don't know it yet. Right, Text her right now. Are you awake? I'm in the mood to disappoint you again. <laughs> <laughs> I wish it wasn't so true. <laughs> when did you find out that Santa Claus wasn't real? I never thought he was real. <laughs> I was like, that's such a stupid idea that a man comes down and get I know it's you guys, so I'm trying to bull. <laughs> Can I just tell the vlog audience? Yeah. Like, I'm just looking at, at Jason's phone right now, and his last text to his ex-wife is, It's super stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I didn't want her to think that I'm like gonna ask her like, hey, what happened to our relationship? Why did it crumble? <laughs> <laughs> don't tell her it's my idea. I'm gonna tell her it's your idea. Oh, you don't want me to? No. I want you back. Don't mean he jokes like that, please. Hey, do why and Charlie believe in Santa Claus? Yeah. They do? S still at 11? I'm taping you right now. Yeah, is that okay? <laughs> I just wanted to know if they believe in Santa Claus and then David wanted to tell them that there's no Santa Claus on camera So he wanted to ask you that. what's that? Don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> okay, we won't we won't do it. I told you. Okay, that was it What happened with Natalie and Ella? Do you know that story? What happened with Natalie and Ella? When they found out that there was no tooth fairy and then it was like just Natalie and then she was like, and Santa Claus? And like they, they were like, no, and they went through all of it and she was hysterical and they were like, okay, now send your sister in here. <laughs> Natalie and Ella are the neighbors. Really sweet. A little bit older than Wyatt and Charlie. Josh Peck is here. He'd like a job on SWAT. Yes, please. <laughs> Say hi. Hi, how are you? <laughs> okay, good talk. <laughs> <laughs> All right, don't, don't tell the kids. Let them just have, have a, little bit, a little bit of hope in the world. Okay. D agree, David's buddy. afraid to say anything. He's no, just... I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for the content. <laughs> goodbye. Okay, goodbye. I'll see you in the morning. Bye-bye. Love you. <laughs> 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 I feel like you she sounds delightful. Yeah, she sounds great. <laughs> She's great. Where are you? We need you. You need me for what? For content. For content? Yeah! We grow into the zoo. We need somebody that can talk to the monkeys because they look like a monkey. <laughs> he hung up on me. I'm sorry, that was the wrong way to ask you to do something. I apologize. I mean, I really hurt my feelings, man. Skip the gym, let's go to the zoo. And like I said, we need somebody who's ugly like a frickin' monkey. <laughs> Don't hang up. Ah, Again, I am so, so, so sorry. You're really making this very hard for me to want to come, Jason. I know. You keep calling me a monkey. Okay, so... So meet you at the zoo, I you ape. <laughs> Don't hang up, don't hang up. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You are having a time to get your wife over there.
I'm ready, man. I want to vlog. I love to vlog. I love it. I love my life. How are you? Good. How are you feeling? What's wrong with you today? I'm, I'm, I slept 11 hours. I feel like it's almost backwards. I think your brain's tricking you to think that you're really in it. No, 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 no. And I'm going way out there to come back to right where we need to be. You have a long, you have a long tread back to back. But you're making your way back. Yeah. Yeah. I'm into it. I wish I had two cameras right now to show your face. I really like you as a person. You're a good YouTuber. You're, you're a good friend. You're a very good boyfriend. Oh, I'm not your boyfriend. <laughs> you're very generous. You took us to Las Vegas. Can I borrow you? What do you want? To <laughs> <laughs> See, this is what it's like living in the house. There's just cool people all the time just hanging out. Like, I didn't even know Zane was here. Hi, Zane. It's so good to see you. Do you think I could get a handshake going with the fans that could become known with the fans? Um, that's usually kind of like a young hip thing. Our vlog squad. Yeah. We have a handshake. Okay. Don't know. Show it. <laughs> and then it just, it just shows our camaraderie. Exactly. <laughs> and here's my secret handshake. Four and a thing. So if you see me on the street, if a fan sees me on the street, I'm gonna see if this will catch on. I think I just nailed it. Ah! <laughs> You're lit. Hey, you wanna see my new handshake? It's four times slaps, blow it up. I think it's gonna catch on. Kristen, you wanna see my new handshake? Okay. Ready? I'm scared. I know, I know. Honestly, I'm not gonna go out. hard, I'm not gonna go hard. Ready? Sick. It's one thing to have an animal guy, but to be able to say, oh yeah, you know, my hot pepper guy. <laughs> I got my hot pepper guy. You have a snake guy, a hot pepper guy. Got to be guys for everything, dog. I got a hat guy. Oh yeah, I got my ghost guy. My ghost guy's coming by later. Yeah, I got my whale guy. Oh. oh God, David, can you please not drive and be on your phone? Brandon, he's posting an Instagram picture with my merch on. Now shut the hell up! I'm so sorry, I didn't know. We've got three tickets here. We're doing the overnight challenge, so we're probably gonna spend the night here. Don't tell anyone. Oh, okay. Doesn't matter to me. <laughs> Have fun. I loved her answer. I just want you to leave. Just do it. <laughs> Four times. Oh, okay. That's that it. Just it? blow it up. Oh, okay. Well, my hand hurts now. Feels like we're going like on a hike. Yeah. <laughs> my butt is soaked. Swamp ass. It wouldn't kill you to wear some shorts once in a while. It's so nice to be here without children. Wanna go home and play Xbox? I want dip and die. <laughs> I forgot who I'm with. We don't stop at 7-Eleven to get Slurpees. I'm gonna tell mom that you're cheating on her. Carry me. <laughs> Jesus. Thanks, Jason. I'm happy now. Check out my new handshake. Hey, yo, what's up, Jesse? Oh, what's up? Well, you wow. gotta get, you know, bump it, though. You gotta no. get a bump. No, bump. Not, no bump. not my handshake. You think he looks fat on camera? I think I just look taller in uh, person. Yeah. If he looks fat, I can't imagine what I look like. John Goodman. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> I wish I could like be that calm for one moment in my life. You get any peppers, man? No, you need like a straight up dude, and my guys just can't. It'll take a couple days to get them in. When David doesn't get his peppers, he gets upset. This is why you need two pepper guys, which <laughs> I've been trying to tell Alex. I think David's done. I was like a little kid. We're like, a zoo! And then he, was, he goes, oh. <laughs> I literally, I came into the zoo, was excited, then got tired, then ate an ice cream cone, and now I'm even more tired. That was my zoo experience. It yeah. is kind of sad, isn't it? Yeah, we should have just gone to the Holocaust Museum. <laughs> Would have been a little more upbeat. It's a family. Um, Wyatt, David has yeah. something. David wanted to tell you something. Okay. Um, hey, Wyatt. Hey, hey, David. How was school? It was cool. Hey, um, I got some new socks. Oh, awesome. Yeah, thanks. They're cool. Just uh, can, I, can I tell you something, actually? Why, um... <laughs> Santa Claus isn't real. What, what? Santa's not real. He's kind of just something that your parents tell you to believe in. It's not real at all. Your parents, your parents buy your presents. <laughs> Dad, why are, you, why are you recording this? <laughs> Wait, hold on. Um, <laughs> Sounds like a tea kettle. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> something in my, something in my eye. Wyatt, can you come back for a second? Yeah, David. Uh, <laughs> Wyatt. Um, yeah, David. The tooth fairy's bull. <laughs> <laughs> Simmer down, won't you love? I'm taking one for the team. We taking shots till it's love. You never know where we can end up. Need this bar, raise the bar for you. I hate your wardrobe in the winter. Don't you come around. Play, 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 play games, play.
God, that was so spot on. He's like, he's a sweetheart. He's like a proud kid. He's so he sweet. He would fall to pieces in front of us. What's up everybody, please hit like and subscribe, tweet me at Jason Nash, Instagram at Jason Nash. Today's shout out is Emmy. Emmy, thank you so much for watching. Todd is back from Croatia. He brought us a gift. Brought you some absinthe, Jason. It'll make you hallucinate. Well, Todd, you've been absent for a long time. <laughs> I wish they deported me already. <laughs> Don't forget to check out our podcast, Views. We're gonna talk all about the deportation and the DACA and everything tonight. Yeah, as soon as David uploads, we're gonna start recording, so look Tune for it. Uh, check out the merch, link in the description. Here's the shirt, here's the pink hoodie. <laughs>